Hello friends, this video on coordinate geometry part 14 is brought to you by examfear.com. No more fear from exam. Before watching this video, please make sure that you have watched part 1 to part 13. The question says if two vertices of an equilateral triangle is 0, 0, and 3, 0, 3, we have to find the third vertices. So let's see what the question is trying to say. This is an equilateral triangle ABC. We are told that 1 is 0, 0 and this is 3, root 3. That's it. And C you have to find. Let us assume this is x, y. We know that all the distances are same. That is AB is equal to BC is equal to AC. In an equilateral triangle, AB is equal to BC is equal to AC. First thing we can do is we can find the length of BC. Uh, sorry, AB because it is given. A and B points are given. And we can then say that uh, we can find the length of AC, we can find the length of BC that will come in the terms of X and Y. So we have two equations, two variable, we'll get the answer. I'll show you. BC is nothing but root of sorry BA. First let's find BA. Root of 3 minus 0 square, 3 minus 0 square plus 2 3 minus 0 square. This comes out to be 3 square is 9 plus root 3 square is 3. That is root of 12. So BA is root 12. Correct. BC if you find or uh, let's find AC. AC. AC is nothing but the root of x minus 0 square plus y minus 0 square. That is x minus 0 square plus y minus 0 square. And that is nothing but root of x square plus y square. And BC if you find, BC is nothing but the root of x minus 3 square plus y minus root 3 square. Correct. These three are all same. So you will get two equations. One you say root x square plus y square is equal to 12. So one is root of x square plus y square is equal to root 12. Or squaring both side we get x square plus y square is equal to 12. This is my first equation. Second equation I will get x minus 3 square plus y minus root 3 square. I am saying bc square. bc square also is equal to ba square. That is 12. This is my second equation. So I have two equations in terms of x and y. I solve this, I get the answer. What is it do? Since I have two equations in terms of x and y, I solve this, I get the values of x and y. Let's try this. Expand this, this becomes x square plus 9 minus 6x plus y square plus 3 root 3 square minus 2 root 3y is equal to 12. x square plus y square we know is what? 20, 12 actually. So it is by 12, so this becomes 12 plus 9 minus 6x plus 3 minus 2 root 3y is equal to 12. Or you get 6x plus 2 root 3y is equal to 12 plus 9, 21, 21 plus 3, 24, 24 minus 12, 12. Or I get a 2 at a common, I can get 3x plus root 3y is equal to So I have two equations. I can solve this. So from this, if I get uh, y, let's suppose y, I get 12 minus 3x by root 3. If I put this in this equation, equation 1, we'll get x square plus y square, that is 12 minus 3x by root 3 square is equal to 12. If I solve this, this is one equation only in terms of x, right? If I solve this, you can solve this if you want. If you solve this, you'll get the equation in terms of x. I'll not solve this for you, you can solve this on your own. Once you get x, you can get the value of y. You'll get two values of x. Actually, I can tell you the answer also. You'll get x as, you can solve this, x as 0 and 3 actually. You get x is 
0 and 3, two values. Since you get x is 0 and 3, you can put this value of x and y and you'll get the value of y. You can get the two values of y. y you'll get as uh, 2 root 3 and minus 3. So there are two possible combinations of x and y. Let's take some example. The question says find the coordinates of the circumcenter of the triangle whose vertices are 8, 6, 8 minus 2, 2 minus 2. Also, we have to find the circumradius. So this is a triangle, right? And we need to find the circumcenter. Circumcenter is a circle here, like this. This is the circle, not proper, but this is how it should be. So this is point A, B, C, and the points are eight comma six, eight comma minus two, and two comma minus two, right? And there is a circumcenter. Let's suppose O. We have to find the coordinates of O. Also, we have to find this radius R. First, find O. You know that. OA will be equal to OB is equal to OAZ. They are all circumradius. So we can say square will also be same. OA square will be equal to OB square equal to OC square. So let's find uh, OA and OB square. So OA square will be x minus 8. OA square is nothing but x minus 8 square plus y minus 6 square. Right? Similarly, OB square will be x minus 8 square plus y minus or y plus 2 square. If you equate these two, what you will get? OA square is going to be, or let me find OC square also first. OC square is nothing but x minus 2 square plus y plus 2 square. Correct. So first is OA, uh, first we will equate OA square is equal to OB square. So what we get? x minus 8 square plus y minus 6 square is equal to x minus 8 square plus y plus 2 square. Correct? Cancel. If you solve this, we get y square plus 36 minus 12y. This is equal to y square plus 4 plus 4y. y square, y square cancel. So you get 16y is equal to 36 minus 4, that is 32, or y is equal to 4. y is equal to 2 is equal to 4. Do you know what y is equal to To find the value of x, what we can do? We can equate these two equations. Because if you equate these two equations, OB, OC, what will happen is, y part anyway it gets cancelled. So in second, we'll say, OB square is equal to OC square, or, x minus 8 square plus y plus 2 square is equal to x minus 2 square plus y plus 2 square. Cancel. So I'll get x minus 8 square is equal to x minus 2 square. I'll get x square plus 64 minus 16x is equal to x square plus 4 minus 4x. x square x square cancel. What I'll get is uh, 16x minus 4x is 12x is equal to 64 minus 4 that is 60 or x is equal to 5. So I got the value of x, I got the value of y. They would O is nothing but 5 comma. Correct? I got the value of center that is 5 comma. Now I got the value of the center, I can find the radius, I can take any distance. OA, OB, AC, everything is same. So, circumradius will be, R will be, root of, you can take any A point, let me take this OA only, that is 5 minus 8 square plus 2 minus 6 square root, that is root of 5 minus 8 is minus 3, minus 3 square is 9, plus 2 minus 6 is minus 4, minus 4 square is 16, that is root 25, and that is 5, the 5 unit is a radius of the or circum radius of this very simple you have got this triangle we have this point and we know that OA square is equal to OB square is equal to OC square we found this using this equation we found the value of x and y once we found the value of x and y there is a circum center we found the circum radius thank you 
visit examfear.com to watch free educational videos, try free online tests, get the best quality study materials, study from the best tutors and mentors and much more. Thanks once again.